What's up, guys? I'm Shane, and welcome back to our Monmouth Hawks Prestige Dynasty, where uh, Fresno State actually is not eliminated from this division, somehow. Alabama has got, obviously, their one last game. It will be against Fresno State. They have the tiebreakers over Virginia Tech and Western Kentucky already, but if Fresno State manages to pull off the upset over Ohio State, Oklahoma, and Alabama, again, tall order, they would tie Bama and have the tiebreaker and clinch a division, so... It's not going to happen. It's going to be Bama. All right. This game, we're going to be going to SoFi Stadium, taking on the Casper College Thunderbirds, our last dynasty. And I would assume most people's favorite dynasty off the channel so far. Actually, you guys, I don't, you know, I don't usually do this stuff, but let me know in the comments which one was actually your favorite. Because I'm curious. And I, I ran a poll a while ago, but it was like in the beginning of Casper, um, BlackRock finished last. Looking at the views, I can kind of guess and see which ones are the favorite, but just, I don't know. Let me know which one is your favorite. Anyways, it's time for a bird battle. I can't tell if the stadium's completely full or if the white is more Monmouth supporters or if those are empty seats. I genuinely can't tell. Also, we have to win this game before we can officially clinch our division, so technically nothing's wrapped up. Wow, Slant's play was the play. <laughs> Sims, 40 yards on that. Perfect. Wow, that safety saw Underwood and sprinted in the other direction. He made a business decision. I kind of would like for Husky to go for the passing record in the game. It's the only record he doesn't actually hold. Um... It doesn't have to be this game. I just like from the go for it. I'd also like Underwood to go for a couple records too. Because might as well wrap it up. Ooh, Underwood could stop short. I think in the future, like obviously I still want to have Casper and Monmouth and Blackrock be in future dynasties as long as I can. Which is going to require a team builder. But the upside is apparently, and we get another touchdown there. Um, FCS schools might be coming to a DLC in the future, so Monmouth might not have to be something I make. They might just automatically be a school, which would be amazing. All right. I don't know what style I like to play. They're going for toss play. Um, because their nope. rush offense sucks and their pass offense sucks, so I don't know which one they actually prefer. But we can't stop the run, so I guess they're going to prefer that. That was... That was a pretty good catch there, Bennett. Thank you! Oh my god, Morton! <laughs> that was beautiful anticipation in for the pick six. I was like, oh, they might have something going on offense here. We might actually have like a good rival game. Like, you know, like a back and forth. Good show. Nope. Nope, Morton just jumped that one. Woohoo, that blitz got there. Good job, Hayes. Play action pass. Oh, uh, in that case, I'm going to undo. I was going to call a blitz. That would have been a mistake. It just... Okay. I got caught up in, like, the giant cluster in the middle. And he threw it away. It was third down, bud. This wasn't the play I called. I called play action... I called PA read. Well, Herman gets a rushing attempt for no gain. There we go. Just everyone watch. They're like, we're going to play zone coverage and just watch people run past us. Coach went immediately for four verts. Okay. I just like this one because it's Tuggle out here. Tuggle didn't. Nope. Tuggle covered. Everyone's covered. Never mind. There goes Sims. Ooh, that, uh... I tried to anticipate that one, and I threw it directly to where he was standing. Well, the 
Hey, Husky hasn't had a pass hit the ground yet. That's all that matters. Oh, good toe drag by that guy. Bennett's having a good day. He's the only one on Casper having a good day. That wasn't even anywhere near anyone you were trying to throw that to. Okay, we almost got that first. I'm like, I got the Coach Adamas thing. It's like, hey, it's going to be an inside tackle run. I'm like, blitz? He still almost got it. Uh, I don't think they see a pass coming here. Good broken tackle by Herman, and he picks up the first. I was really hoping for Randall on that, but they, they covered him up. Whoa! Husky, not the time, but if I'm trying to go for a passing record for you, I need to not have that 10 accuracy pop up. He just hasn't really been throwing picks all season, so he's going to do it all today instead. End of the first quarter, we're up 14-0 on Casper, but uh, it, it feels like Husky's having a hell of a meltdown. All right, well, good third down stop there. And they're going for it. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, we got him. Okay. <laughs> those how those toss plays scare the crap out of me, but I forgot I have haze. Alright, good catch by Herman. There we go. So we we can work the sidelines today. We can't work the middle of the field, is what I'm finding out. I'm gonna keep trying the middle of the field anyways. All right, there we go. The play that made Watkins famous in Buffalo. Apparently, it's going to work for Sims here. Coach is really tempting me. He's like, here's a play that's going to put Randall White open in the corner of the end zone. Except, oh, he was—he well, actually did get open. My bad. Husky in for the rushing touchdown. <laughs> that works, too. Okay. Okay, third and six. Defense is, uh... Well, they're playing a lot better now that they're not trying to run the ball, which means it's... Oh, it's not a draw play. Thought I jinxed myself there for a second. Thank you! Brown getting a pick. All right, well... And I hurdled him on accident, but that's fine. Okay. We've thrown two picks. He's thrown two picks. We're even again. Zone blitz coming. Well, I was already coming out in four verts, so... Please don't cover Randall. They didn't cover Randall. Ah, Tuggles is having trouble with those contested catches. I mean, anyone would have trouble with that one, but still. <laughs> they lost Herman completely. 17 yards on that one. And Underwood in for the rushing touchdown. This is what we're doing today, apparently. We're going to throw the ball, get most of the yards, and then a rushing touchdown. He went to take off, taken down. I think, is Hicks getting credit for that one? Hicks got credit for that one. Good. He deserved it. Yeah, unfortunately, the D tackle on this team, DT1, is making all the plays so far. And DT2, completely forgotten about. So, Hicks, after uh, an incredible year last year, he's getting outshined. And Roman Reigns doing what he does best. Great run defending D-end. Oh, come on, man. I get like he had a lot of time back there, but we got to we got to cover better than that. Oh. <laughs> that didn't go well for him. Good good job. You can have that 4 yards. Okay, we're just I I got to abandon zone coverage. We're getting shredded up. Okay, never mind. We got shredded on man, too. Third and ten, Coach tried to call jam cover. I respect it, Coach. It is my favorite play, but it's not the time. Edmund! Everyone else is getting a little bit of redemption arc this season, except for Edmund. He's just still awful. He's just getting dusted. Constantly. Okay, the whole defense just assumed he got tackled and everybody gave up.
Oh my god, that was a beautiful cut there by Sims. Good snag by King. See, that's what I'm expecting out of these guys, to hang on to stuff like that. Aw, oh, Vassar getting his, like, one of the few opportunities he's going to have all season. Dropping PA smash. Uh, fourth and one, I know I want passing stats, but we got to go for the first down here real quick. Which means the battering ram. Holy cow. That's one of the worst sacks you'll ever see anyone take. I was trying to run around to go to the right to get out of the pocket to throw it away. Uh, and I didn't notice that guy until I had already committed to running that direction. Well, now we have to go for four verts. Because we need something to go down the field that far. Okay. Good swap by the safety. I thought I had Underwood there. There it is. 25 yards. We're getting it to fourth and two. Run, hurry up. Ooh, that guy thought he stopped it. He got back there and Underwood's like, nah, I'm, I'm going to keep going. King. Oh, I was trying to get him in. Still, he gets the catch. Out of bounds. Clock stops. I mean, we've got plenty of timeouts anyway, so it doesn't matter. And in for another touchdown. And in the first half, we're up 35-7 on Casper College. He's trying to take... Oh, he got off Sims. He did not get off Sims that time. Is that the record now? That's right, he was sitting at 14, right? Yeah, there it is. School record for sacks in a season. He took last week off, but he's got it now. Ooh, Wilkerson trying to go for an athletic pick there. They don't they don't see this coming. That guy got dusted. I need to get Underwood stats somewhere. So it's 250 passing yards now. I forget how many I need. There we go. I had Sims. I put him on a slant. He just couldn't get any release. 15 yards, and once again, we're on the goal line. Husky still doesn't have a passing touchdown, and I don't think he's going to have one here. Oh, he got denied. There it is. I just looked it up, um, and by looked it up, I mean I just watched the video I uploaded yesterday. Uh, we need 481 passing yards to break the record. Come on. Oh, Morton. I was hoping you go for pick number two. Throws that one out. Ooh, Edmund pass deflection. Again, I need you to come down with a pick. Oh, you know what? I think we had a cornerback in the visit I saw before the game. We've actually met the interception requirements for him. Obviously, we only got the one pass deflection now, it looks like, so. But still, like, we actually met a recruit, like a cornerback, his, uh, his desires, so that's neat. On a recruit that I don't know the name of and I'm never gonna see him again. We need 200 more yards. Actually, 201. We gotta break the record, not tie it. Take the dump off. Okay, this is the play I tried to call earlier where I got a Wildcat instead. Oh, the Blitz. I'm, I, I got excited because I had Randall wide open. But uh, that Blitz actually got there. But I am going for records, and I don't have time for punting. Uh, I'll just take the first and go out of bounds immediately. I didn't realize I had circle open because I couldn't see him at first. And by the time I saw him, he wasn't going to be able to get the first down. Watch for the zone blitz, and guess who just called the screen? This might be perfect. It, it was not perfect. Oh, slightly inaccurate, but Tuggle got it anyways on a dive. Coach went right back into PA smash. Out of control. 
And the cheat. Cheat spun that guy around. Leave Underwood uncovered again? No, he actually did his job. He didn't cover McAllister, though. And the cheat in for a touchdown. We need 151 yards. And I don't know if he's going to see the field for that long. Well, you know what? They need more yards because I need to not start off at midfield. That's kind of like the biggest drawback to go for this record right now. Okay, good, good, good job, Edmund. Just constantly letting me down. You can't cover a curl, you can't cover an out, you can't cover a slant, you can't cover a streak. What can you cover? Oh, look. I mean, that was zone coverage. I guess that's more understandable. Bullock not being able to cover makes sense. He's a run-stopping linebacker. Of course he can't cover, and his coverage was still tighter. Now would be a good time for a pick, though, because we'd start with a short, with like a long field. See, look at Morton. Look at Morton actually getting a pass breakup again. Watch for the PA pass. Well, I wasn't expecting a toss play. Never mind. Watch out for them to jump off sides. Fourth and 15 for them now. What's their plan? They're going to punt it. End of the third quarter, we're up 49-7 on Casper, but I, I I don't think this passing yards record is happening. Oh, King broke a tackle and then he lost like five or six yards. Yep, they were allergic to King that time. Made up for those yards he just lost. They lost Randall. They completely lost Randall. With the truck. Trying to break some more tackles, taking that down to the two-yard line. 410 yards now today. I just got PTSD. I have thrown three straight incompletions, but mostly because I'm trying to force it. Uh, I'm not going to bother with the screen pass. It's fourth down. Let's go for the touchdown here. Yeah. <laughs> he's got five rushing touchdowns for the second straight week. I think he's got 30 yards on the ground. All right, third and seven. They seem to be confused about what they should do. Like, they're literally trying everything. Morton. He's still trying to go for that other pick. That's three pass deflections, though. Almost single-handedly impressing the recruits. This punter is a jerk. We need 72 yards to break the record. He punted it out at the 31. So we don't, we need three more yards. So I'm going to have to take a penalty somewhere, I'm assuming. I was going to take the penalty there, but I kind of like the look. Oh, God. Well, does that go against his rush yards or his pass yards? I think it's his pass yards, so it doesn't help me. Nope, incorrect. That's right. College, it goes against his rushing yards, not his passing yards. We're good. Now we have enough field. I got to take it off two clock, though, before I forget. Randall wide open, picking up 29. 11 more yards. We got the room to do it. Herman gets nine of it. And no one on Randall again. That is the record. That's Randall getting a touchdown. Well deserved. He's had a hell of a game. And now Husky has all the passing records. And that should presumably wrap it up. I don't know if the starters are going to be out here, but uh, that should be ball game. All right, that is the beatdown completed. I have a feeling that Underwood's about to go off on BlackRock. Because, <laughs> I mean, they're, they're worse overall than we are. So he's got records he's got to go for, which I already forgot what he needs. But Underwood taking player of the game, even though... Oh, well, it's because of the lack of passing touchdowns. 
final stats. Husky, 30 of 45, 490 yards, two touchdowns, two picks, two sacks. I mean, I was committed to passing the ball. I was chucking it in places I should not have. Especially after we got the first two picks out in the first quarter. Figured, why not? Rushing, Underwood had 28 on the ground for five touchdowns. Hell of a day. Husky with negative nine. Bray had negative two in garbage time. McAllister had one for 17. And Herman, uh, well, didn't go in your stat sheet, I guess. Underwood, seven for 119. Um, the receiving record, he does not have that yet, which I believe is like 240 or something yards in a game. I don't think he's going to get it, but I'm going to more focus on the rushing stats, honestly. Herman, 5 for 63. King, 5 for 53. Randall at 4 for 97 and a touchdown. Hey, he woke up. Sims at 4 for 95. The Cheat, 3 for 40 and a touchdown. McAllister, 1 for 8. Tuggle, 1 for 15. Manning getting a pancake. Couple sacks here. You don't usually see that with us lately. Willis leading the team with six tackles, but uh, Morton having himself a day with... Well, okay, Brown had a pick, but Morton a pick six, 39 yards, and three pass deflections. Reigns of the TFL, Sims with a sack, Hayes and Broly getting TFLs, and Hicks with a sack. Oh, Edmund and Wilkerson also getting pass deflections. All right, that will wrap this one up. This is the last time you're going to see Casper in NCAA 14 because uh, they have now fallen to one and nine. They are completely irrelevant, and uh, yeah, they ain't, they ain't the same Casper that we know, but... Yeah, that'll wrap this one up. We, we, I mean, I don't know the timing of it. We're, what, we're less than a week away from College Football 25. So be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those notifications on because I'm going to be coming at you basically as soon as possible. Like, hopefully within a couple hours of launch of the game, you're getting some College Football 25 content. <laughs> but anyways, like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. Until next time. If anyone would like to take my fiance off my hands, I'll give you the address. You can have her. Until next time, I'm Shane. I'm out.